What's good, YouTube? It's your West Guys Jordan. I keep getting the same question over and over and over and over and over. I keep getting like five DMs every day. People asking me, um, how do you set up the way it's doing real time? It's not working for me. It's not working for me. Look, this is a step-by-step -step process right here. Like, make sure you follow along. Make sure you check in to make sure you've done what I've done. I'm going to walk you through step-by-step. -step in GarageBand, so you know exactly you can apply this to any DAW, and you shouldn't have no problems. So, on the screen, look here, this is what we have. We have Waze to in real time, it's set, this is the default. So look, this is what it sounds like on default. Yo, 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 yo. Hey, right, you know, so, hey, right, what you wanna do? You wanna turn the speed down 0 0.1. No transition now. Yo, yo, yo. Okay, we kinda hear it, but it's out of key, it's not in key, right? It's not, it's not right. So, the beat. So, we got the beat here. I used mixed in key, and I got the key for the beat. So, it's B minor. B minor, right? So, B minor. We look over here. B minor. And if we wanted to put in D major, we could put it in D major. Because D major is B minor. But, it is B minor. So, if you don't have mixed in key, or any other, like, it, or any other key finder what you want to do is go online and go to like tune that or just be like free online key finder or bpm finder and it's gonna you upload a beat and it's gonna tell you the key the scale and the bpm and when you get that you have to change it this is the thing you have to change it for every beat because every beat is not the same key your voice is not going to be in the same key every single time for different songs like it's no it's not it don't work like that a lot of people i feel like a lot of people think that once you set was one key for every song is it, it don't work that way okay so it's in b minor so here we go b major minor yeah 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 yo. like it's there but we really can't hear it so what do we do when we can't hear it so now we just have to add some compression. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You want to boost the signal so you can hear it. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. So it's on, right? But if you wanted to hear it a little bit better, what we're going to do, we're going to put some reverb on here. And on how we're going to put the reverb on, it's going to be, it's up to you. Because you can't really bust this out in GarageBand. So you can put it on buses and stuff. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to put on voice centric because it's actually cool. So, yo, 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 no, 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 yeah, yeah, no. All right, so look, all right, so look, that's the way it's from set up, step by step, that's it. That is it, man. Uh, let me turn this delay down so you know I'm not playing with y'all. So here we go, man. So just so y'all know, here we go. Let me record. And it should be working, right? It should be working. We got the scale set right. Right? I'll be right. All right, so look, here we go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's set, right? So here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Play it back, and it's on there, right? Go crazy with it. So it works. 
Like it's, it works. That's that's how easy it is. Like it's so simple to set it up, right? So look now, I'm gonna show you where you mess up it, right? Is when you get to trying to touch all this stuff and just do all kind of things. So um, if we if we want to just lock it to soprano, if we if you click soprano, right? You're not gonna get the effect. So yeah, yo Haitian, go crazy Whoa. with it. <laughs> Like, you see that? Like, if we click Soprano, my notes are down here. That's what you want to pay attention to, where your notes at. That's why you leave it in generic, right? Like, this is the biggest issue that people have because they want to get to touching things and they just think, like, if I do it like this, it'll sound better. No, it won't sound better, right? Like, if you click this, you're going to get some of the notes, but you're not going to get all of the notes. So, play it again. Whoa, 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 whoa. So like right here we get notes right so if i click just bass i'm gonna get all my notes except for the high ones right so i can click there and hit play so we getting the notes we getting the notes so right here are we gonna get the notes No, we don't get the notes to see that blacked out. So if you leave it here in generic, you're gonna get all of your notes, right? Another thing, make sure this is on. Make sure the pink on button is on. If it's great, that means it's not on. You wanna have it on. And it depends on you with your correction speed, right? So if you want it to be robotic, you wanna hit on honey. If you don't really want it to be like noticeable, you dial it back until it's not noticeable. Then if you want the transition speed, to be faster, you bring it slower. Like if you want the transition speed to be up, you can bring it up, you know, bring it down. If you want the speed to be up you or down, you mess with that. All right, like that's really it, man. You really don't do too much. Like just because this is in B minor here, doesn't mean your song is gonna be in B minor. You need to find the key and the scale, all right? Step one. First thing that you need to do, man, find the key. Number two, find the scale, right? That's very important, key and the scale. If you don't have the key or the scale right, the auto-tune, ways tune the ways tune real time is not going to be set right, all right? Then you want to bring the speed down to 0 0.1. Note transition to 0 0.1. Correction to 100. Make sure the pink button is on, and you want to make sure it's on generic. So if you had, let's say, B flat minor, was the B flat minor was the key in the scale, right? So what you want to do, you would hit B, you would hit the minor, then you, not, <laughs> I said it backwards, you would hit the B, you would hit the flat, and then you would put it in minor, right? Or if it was E flat minor, whatever. If, it, if you had a sharp here, you would click the sharp, whatever. That's it, man. You just, it's that simple. It's not that hard. You just want to make sure you have the plugin set right. You want to have some compression to where you can hear the effect, right? And if you want to make it even better for you to record with, you want to have some reverb. I can't stress that enough. Waste some red time, compression, and uh, some reverb. That's, that's it, man. That's it. Step by step. That's how you get the ways to act right. Trust me, man. Like, I do this, bro, a lot. Like, I have a lot of videos using these plugins man trust me if you just make sure you're doing this right you will be okay so make sure you have the note transition right the speed right the correction right the scale the key all that has to be right if the key, if the key and the scale is not correct it will not be right and that's just that's just what it is okay but make sure you like comment subscribe to the channel it's your boy Scott Jordan. I'm out of here, right? <laughs>